If you're interested in entry level cloud jobs, whether in office or remote, stay until the end of this video. Hey VFC fam, it's your boy Joshua Tech Dev Walker, your venti fried chicken author and global cloud slinger. If you're into cloud tech and creativity, then smash that subscribe button. So for those that don't know, I am a solutions architect at a global firm, and I'm happy to report that finding an entry level cloud job is a lot easier than it used to be. To give you a little perspective of how I found my role. So I wanted to jump head first into cloud computing. So I started working with a lot of the startups in the local Orlando scene, Orlando tech scene. And I was plugged into this accelerator where they got free cloud credits. And I basically said, hey guys, instead of paying me directly, how about you pay me in them credits? That aligned with some successes there and me doing some speaking engagements you know, just around the Orlando tech scene, I was discovered by the company I now work for right now. As you can see, that was a lot of hard work, but that was also a lot of luck. And this was pre-pandemic. Luckily, you don't need any of that. Wow. Jokes aside, speaking at meetups and doing webinars and things of that nature is not a waste of time. There's definitely still a life hack of getting attention for new roles. However, the main site that I recommend for entry-level cloud jobs on a daily basis is LinkedIn. No, they aren't a sponsor. Help me LinkedIn, I'm poor. So a prerequisite is definitely setting up your profile. There are plenty of videos on YouTube about what to put there, but you could just look at my profile and steal like an artist. Or look at people that are way more accomplished than me and steal from their profile. And by steal, I mean the example. Don't actually just steal their, you know, don't lie. So let's jump right into the mechanics, shall we? First, you're gonna wanna log in and head to jobs. And I'm gonna clear my suggestions personally so that it looks more like what you'll see when you log in for this video purpose. To keep it broad, I'm just gonna search cloud and just filter down afterwards. It's asking if I wanna set an alert and I'm gonna say not right now and you'll see why in a second. Now, normally if someone was, you know, had experience, they will filter down based on their level. But because we're talking about entry level cloud jobs, I'm gonna only filter down by internships and entry level jobs for cloud computing. And we're gonna also specifically look at remote roles. If you're good with going into an office, obviously don't filter down more. And unlike DevOps, LinkedIn provides an easy button meaning they will scrape your profile for you instead of you having to do manual entry, which is why the prereq is to stack your profile like Jenga, but hopefully less volatile. Now, if you're happy with kind of these settings and this criteria, you can set LinkedIn to send you email notifications when jobs like this come up. Fantastic. And to kind of wrap up and give a few more tips, you can also filter by your dream job, basically. You can also filter by part-time, full-time, and contracts. Now you can hopefully use this knowledge and go ham on applying, holiday style. Please tag me on social media if you end up landing in role using this technique. Also, let me know if you want me to show other places where you can find entry-level cloud jobs. Once again, if you're interested in cloud, tech, or creativity, subscribe, and definitely like this video if it helped you. Train, inspire, relate.